Hello Church, I just wanted to update you on the changes ahead as we move into two back-to-back -back celebrations on Sunday mornings uh, from the 27th of September, one at 9.30 and another one at 11 a.m. Uh, before I talk about this, let me uh, remind you that our brothers and sisters in Victoria would love to be in the position that we're in. I've got a friend of mine who pastors the church in Victoria and he's been in lockdown for months, uh, they would love to be in the position that we are in right now. So let me encourage you to make the most of the opportunity that God has given us in the ACT to meet together as his people on Sundays. Uh, now, what we've done this week, uh, this week uh, we've consulted with our key ministry leaders. We've, we've basically talked to people about how this plan is going to work uh, across uh, celebration leading, Solid Rock, Bible Kids, Open Up, Lock Up, uh, Sound, Music, and a whole range of ministries that go into making Sunday mornings happen. So that's what we've done this week. Next week, uh, the staff team will sit together and start allocating uh, or forming these two congregations. Now you might be, the first thing that probably comes to your mind, am I in the 9.30 or am I in the 11 a.m.? Very good question. Uh, basically, there's no rocket science to this. Uh, basically, we want to ensure that all our ministries are well supported and there's an equal mix of children and youth in both the 9.30 and 11 a.m. Now, as I say this, I also want to say that this is going to be a hard transition for a lot of us. And some of us are going to have to learn to jump, come to church half an hour early at 9.30 and the other half is going to have to learn to come to church late at 11 a.m. But let me encourage you to think like the Apostle Paul when he, what he writes in uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 10. Verse 24, Paul writes, No one should seek their own good, but the good of others. Why? Because the gospel demands it. We also want to form congregations so that it's possible for us to have visitors every Sunday uh, so that we can seek the good of others by inviting them to church. Uh, so keep that in mind. That's happening next week. Uh, let me also remind you to register if you're an SPC partner at our partner vision meetings that are happening between the week of the 21st to the 24th of September. So let me uh, uh, encourage you to continue to pray for the church, uh, come along, uh, be energized about the mission that God has given us to reach people with the gospel of grace. Uh, so I encourage you to do that and I'll see you all soon uh, on one of these Sundays. Thanks guys.